Because of barrel, more than 1,700 flights were canceled at airports nationwide. A majority of that impact was felt here in Texas, with many airlines monitoring the storm and rerouting travelers as necessary. Our Nicole Nielsen joins us now live from DFW Airport. And Nicole, I know you've been monitoring delays for us today, so how are things looking? Yeah, right now I can tell you here at DFW Airport, we're talking about departure delays of about half an hour, but really the problem is in the numbers. Here today alone, 273 flights have been delayed and 43 have been canceled. The numbers put DFW Airport with the third most cancellations behind Houston Hobby and Bush. In total, between the three, we're talking about almost 800 cancellations across Texas. American Air and Southwest Airlines both had statements today about the storm. American saying American Airlines is monitoring the track of Tropical Storm Barrel and has issued a travel alert, allowing customers whose travel plans are affected to rebook without change fees. Meanwhile, Southwest says we expect to see changes to our schedule this evening into tomorrow afternoon and will continue to monitor conditions and make adjustments to our schedule as necessary. Meanwhile, airport officials we spoke to say travelers can expect impacts all across the south headed east, including travel towards Arkansas, Tennessee, Louisiana and Florida. We caught up with one family who drove up from Houston this morning when they saw there was no way they were flying out of hobby. I started off at the hotel with the power out, uh, waiting to catch our flight out of Houston. And once it was canceled, decided to make the venture up to Dallas to try to get out of here. <laughs> It was a treacherous drive, yeah. There was trees down. Uh, many times we were driving 10 mile an hour, couldn't really see in front of you, but uh, made it through. <laughs> Now, that family finally did get rebooked here in Dallas for a flight home to Pittsburgh. But just keep in mind that all delays and cancellations are up to the airline, not the airport. So if you do have a flight out of here over the next several days, the best thing you can do is continue to monitor. At DFW Airport, Nicole Nielsen, CBS News, Texas.